Support. Squad 7's R&R. Figured this has got to be big if they put out an emergency call, right? Ah, oh, back into the field again? Militia ever heard of time off? I'm sorry to have called you here so early. I had news for Squad 7 of a pressing nature. The higher-ups were watching, both during your recovery of the Princess and elsewhere. In recognition of those accomplishments, you and I are being granted special leave. Ooh! That's great news. Are you serious? Music to my ears. How wonderful. There's more. We've been granted access to a stretch of shoreline owned by House Randgreeze. House Randgreeze owns a stretch of shoreline? In other words, our orders are to cut loose and relax on a posh private beach. No way. That princess really knows how to up the morale, don't she? The whole place to ourselves. Talk about luxury. Hey, but what should I do? I don't own a swimsuit. Then come on, let's go shopping. I'll pick out something nice for you. <sighs> okay. Wow, it's been years, huh? This should be fun, though, Ys. Yes. Very. We'll leave as soon as you're ready. You've earned this break. Enjoy it. Dismissed. Wow. You can really tell this is a private beach. It's beautiful. The water's so blue. There's not many places this well-preserved around anymore. <gasps> Look at those white wings. Hi, Welkin. <sighs> this, uh, swimsuit was Rosie's idea. Really, I tried to tell her no. I just... I wasn't sure I could pull it off. Um... What do you think? Do I look okay? Uh, mm, mm, it's great, actually. Great? You mean it? Huh? Uh, yeah. That is... You're, you're as pretty as a white-winged gull. I look like a seagull? Yeah. Those wings are just gorgeous. Okay, so... That was a compliment? You bet it was. The white-winged gull is... Just about my favorite bird. Okay. Then thanks, Welkin. Someone's taking this private beach thing a little too literally. It's already hot enough as it is. Rosie! Don't try to pretend. You picked the raciest suit just for the lieutenant, the nervous some girls. Rosie, you're the one who told me to get it. <laughs> okay, <laughs> someone's going in the water. <laughs> Okay, okay. Don't lose your top. Hey. <laughs> hey, Elks. Oh, hey, Ace. You having fun? I am. Been a while since we've come to the beach, hasn't it? Yeah. <laughs> that reminds me. Weren't you afraid of the water, Ace? I remember you clinging to that floaty porcavian. We tried to drag you out, and you started bawling. Welkin, I was barely a toddler then. <laughs> right, sorry. You must be a great swimmer by now. That's... none of your business. Welks! Here goes, Welkin! Ah! Uh, uh. Mike? And down goes the boss. Man, those kids got too much energy. <laughs> You're sounding like an old man, Largo. 
What? I ain't that old. Oh no. Then why did you just sound like my grandfather, hmm? Yeah, yeah. You sure you don't want to go for a swim? I thought you liked that. Nobody wants to see me running around in a skimpy suit like those kids. Not at my age. Whatever you say, Granny. You're no better than I am, are you? You haven't changed a bit since the day you enlisted. You still can't recognize a joke. You still got a mouth on you. Think I'd keel over if that changed. <laughs> Thank you for the lovely compliment. Come to think of it, didn't we all go to the beach just after we enlisted? Yes, we had a big seashell hunt competition. I don't think you found a single one. <laughs> I remember. Yeah, that was a wild time. <laughs> then Frederick winds up soaked to the bone. Largo, no Frederick stories. Oh, hey. I'm, I'm sorry. No, I should apologize. I'm going for a little walk. Over here! Pass the ball over here! Isara! Nail him! Go! Uh, okay. Alright. Hans, did I hit you with that? I'm so sorry. <laughs> she nailed the pig. All by yourself, huh? Why don't you go join them? Nah, that's not my thing. Mm-hmm. Always have to play it cool, huh? Hmm. <laughs> so what, did your journalist duties call you to the beach, or are you just bored? <laughs> Got me there. If I'm spending a day at the beach, I'd rather be with my boyfriend. Oh-ho-ho! -ho! You got yourself a boy, do ya? Color me jealous. Right? There's times when I feel envious of you all, too. I interviewed a good chunk of Galia's army, but I didn't see any other units like yours. True comrades. The bond you guys have is really a cut above the rest. Hmm. <laughs> Get over there already. They're all waiting for you. Well, I could take pity on them. And it's not like chatting with an old married lady is any fun. <laughs> You're a piece of work. All right, guys, make room for me. Oh, a promising contender joins the fray. Rosie, think you could pair up with Isara? What? Sure, fine. Asara, pull your weight or you're swimming. Okay, I'll do my best, Rosie. All right, throw the ball, Asara. Okay. God, don't hit me with it. You're supposed to throw it that way. Rosie, did I hit you with that? I'm so sorry. <laughs> Right, 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 right.